Good morning, another new city. Today we're in Sukhothai. Uh, I'm in the new part of Sukhothai. We need to get 10 kilometers west to the old Sukhothai. And I know you can get a tuk-tuk for about 100 baht. But I'm gonna see if we can find one of these local buses that should be about 30 baht. That's first challenge. So let's try to do that first. Let's go. It's now 7.30. Got to get up early. That's a lot of walking or maybe bike riding. Uh, get it done before the heat. It's already warmed up. So let's try to get this bus. So 100 baht for the little bike, I, I don't know what it was, a tricycle to get here. I couldn't find that bus, I don't know if it still runs. Uh, so 100 baht here, it took about, it was the slowest mode of trade thought. There's a uh, Tuk Tuk's 150 baht, and they are faster, but it's okay. I had to put sun cream on, get ready. Uh, rented a bicycle, 30 baht, and it comes with a lock. And then I've just put a ticket at the ticket office. 100 baht for entry and 10 baht for the bicycle. There are five zones and every zone you got to pay 100 baht and 10 baht. There was a package where you could buy all the tickets, but I think it says it's, they don't do that anymore. Uh, it was okay because the package was 350 baht. Uh, so you would have to go to four zones to get your money back and i read that that could take like two days like it's quite a big area so we'll just do maybe one or two probably two or two areas maybe see how we go it's now eight o'clock let's go let's check out the old town old sukotai let's go all right stop one is what may what my uh it was an assembly hall So we've got a middle point here, stairs coming up. Definitely recommend trying to get here early. I've seen some Bangkok to Sukhothai historical park tours it looks like. So tours come from Bangkok to do this. Uh, there's a bus that just arrived, arrived now. So to beat the crowds and to beat the heat, coming early for sure. Let's keep going, next stop.
cool. This is awesome. And riding right the bike around, so much fun. It's better than walking. This was a uh, chetty, and I think they used to do spiritual, use the water spiritually to cleanse themselves, sort of thing. How they got it now is uh, good fun. I think I just read up into the 70s, they, there was a main road that would go through here. But a lot more clear. You got the sound of the road, but in the, inside you just got the sound of birds. And it's very peaceful actually. A lot of birds. Seen like crows and these blackbirds and white birds. The trees over the trees over here are full of the white birds. So cool. This is cool. Uh, probably get a tour guide, probably a better idea, but you know, you, I've been to a lot of this sort of historic stuff and you sort of get the idea of what you're looking at. Um, but yeah, probably get a tour guide. Uh, doing the, like the bike tour I'm doing now, there's a group that do it for 1500 baht. It goes all day and they give you lunch and stuff. Um, it probably inclu includes all the tickets, so you probably can go to all the venues, which will cost, if I choose to do that, it'll cost about 400 baht anyway, so it's not a bad idea if you want to bike ride with people, get a tour guide, give you information. Um, that's a pretty good thing to do, but I'm happy doing what I'm doing. Explore by myself. Very cool though. It's getting hot though. Where are we at? Quarter to nine. It is 26 degrees. <laughs> That's not the cut. Should I stay here? We're still in that first area, first 100 baht and 10 baht for the bicycle. It's bigger than I thought. I thought the map that I got, this was extra. So there's, this is just the middle one, the popular one. This one looks, it's got elephants coming out. Very cool, this is where all the gardeners and landscapes come to have a break. That's probably what you're paying for. It's a huge ground, so they need a lot of landscapers, gives them a job. So that's, uh, and it's pretty well maintained. Bit of trash some places, but pretty well maintained. It's a big area for them to look after. 
and this first section 100 right, well worth it. it's amazing if you can get a tour that would be better or yeah do one of the bike tours I, I like riding the bike around I rather, I'm glad I did this than walking I get tired walking all right I'm gonna try to find the next section I think we're heading north the north gate maybe I'll see how we go let's go Okay, this is the north entrance. Another 100 baht and 10 baht for the bicycle. I think I could probably could walk it, but I'm not. We'll just go for a bike ride. All right, let's check it out. This is the north. Very cool. This one's a bit smaller, this area, but so much more detail on this thing. We'll go for a quick bike ride around this area, see if there's anything else. Yeah, it's getting hot, but very cool. Very good historic thing to see. Obviously stuff has been damaged over the years, but they try to make it look authentic as best as they can. Um, this section you probably don't need to bring the bike in if you want to save 10 baht, but uh, it's still pretty cool. Beautiful day and so many birds make different noises. There's, there's a bird back over there. I've never heard that sound before. Very peaceful, very nice. Beautiful morning, that was great. The north section is a bit smaller, uh, but look. Got the mountains in the background, blue skies, beautiful. What I suggest, I've done two sections now. What I suggest if you want to see all the sections, there's five sections I believe. Each you got to pay 100 baht, 10 baht for the bicycle. Um, I'd stay in old Sukhothai. I didn't know there was an old and a new. I only found out when I I was booking my bus trip and they asked you want to go old or new and, and I already booked my hotel in the new area. So if you wanted to visit all the areas, I'd probably stay in old Sukhothai. Then you can go see some areas, go back to your hotel, get out of the sun and then go do more in the evening, uh, afternoon, evening. Uh, I think it opens quite late, the site's maybe 6 o'clock or so, 7 o'clock. Uh, so that's what I would do if you want to try smash out all of them. Uh, I'd stay down in old Sukhothai, unless you got your own transport. And also, I definitely, if you can, do a tour for the first section, get that explained to you. I probably should have done that. For me, the two areas is enough, but I wish I learned more about that first area. Um, so I probably recommend you do that. Walking around, doing a tour, two, three hour tour in there. 
they'll tire you out so you probably want to break after that um, if you can do a bicycle tour that's another good idea as well but I've been doing it for two hours two and a half hours and it's hot and the bicycle tour I saw goes all day Whew. it's a long day but yeah I have enjoyed it in Sukhothai this is actually my last city for the um, northern Thailand trip I will go back to Bangkok for the weekend so I'll see you then for that video cheers